All right, guys, how's it going? Uh, I want to do make this video just to give you guys a small, small update. Uh, I, you see here, I got a bunch of these batteries. These are the MH1 batteries, right? That have all stink. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna basically figure out how to use them without breaking them apart and that all that sort of stuff. That's just good stuff that's coming. Unfortunately, though, my warehouse. My partner that we're using to fulfill these orders are kind of backed up. You guys are buying a lot of these batteries. And so they're kind of backed out. They just got a truck with like 2,000 of these uh, battery packs and um, they need to offload them and then break the casings, do a bunch of the stuff, right? So as a result of that, they've asked me if I can take them off uh you know if i can stop selling them for a couple of days so this is only going to be a small temporary they're going to be off off the website as sold out i'll put a i'll put a uh you know a, a, a note in there telling you that it's on temporary and then that ordering will uh resume at another date right but since there's going to be a couple of days that those batteries are not available i'm going to put some other batteries because check this out all of these other batteries are here for review i have to review them i have to check i have to test them these are all e-bike batteries 30 s they have samsung samsung cells uh which which cells which samsung cells let me see um inr oh jesus i can't even tell i can't even tell i have to open one of these packs and then look at it but but they're legit samsung cells their low voltage are around like two volts which is okay that's the that's the the minimum where they should be where they're like they're not you know being damaged and stuff uh and so i'm going to charge a, a few of these and then put them through cycles and then i can be able to tell you you know what the the capacities of these cells and if they're good or not and then we'll put a price around we'll put them in the car so there's that there's also a bunch of these these for you guys that want the lithium iron phosphate look at these apparently there's a maybe a thousand of these things so this is pretty good 48 volts 12 amp hours lithium iron phosphate i will take one of these apart make a video show you uh and then test the cells and see what how much capacity there is in there this is good so lithium iron phosphate is coming also uh then also these guys these are the first ones that are going to be there because these are ready you guys might remember that i did a thing on these 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 modules are pretty cool about one kilowatt hour and uh they're 7s and 8s and they're i mean look at them they're like super cool they're ready to basically throw uh a bms in there and then just you know just parallel a bunch of those and that's your that's your 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 diy uh you know powerwall that's right at 40 uh, 8, 24 volts right 8s and 7s i have two versions of them there's not a ton of them. There's like like half a pallet of each. So unfortunately, those, they're going to go quick. All right, guys. We'll see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned. There's a lot of stuff happening, a lot of stuff coming. Thank you for your support. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.